Yaho and welcome everyone back to my channel. Today's video we're going to be talking about Terrace House. Fuji TV to end reality show Terrace House after cast member's death. Wow. So I'm not sure if this is the whole show. This might just be the season. But let's read a little closer to figure out what happened. Fuji Television will terminate the latest series in its popular reality show, Terrace House, the Japanese broadcaster said Wednesday, four days after one of its cast members was found dead in a suspected suicide believed to have links with cyberbullying fueled by her behavior in an episode. Cyberbullying behavior in an episode. Something you do on TV, people giving their opinions on what you did on TV. Hannah Kimura, a 22-year-old female professional wrestler, was among the six members of Terrace House, Tokyo 2019-2020. to She had posted a picture of herself on Instagram with the words, I'm sorry, shortly before her death was confirmed at a hospital on Saturday. That one kind of, kind of gets me in the feels because... If you're getting a lot of mail, a lot of hate mail from people that you don't even know because of the way you might have acted on a TV series, it it hurts. It hurts, and I I've been feeling down recently, so my my heart definitely goes out to that to that situation. The broadcaster also stopped distributing the series on its internet video distribution service, FOD. We take what happened very seriously. We will address it in a sincere manner. The company said in a release Wednesday, expressing its condolences and sympathies to Kimura's family. The woman who joined the show last September became a target of hateful messages on social media, especially after an episode distributed in late March where she got angry at a male cast member who accidentally shrank one of her wrestling costumes while doing laundry. To take away from that, I do think that... There's this like air of transparency that we have between us and them, between normal people and like celebrities. And for some reason we think that they're not like, they don't have to process through like human emotions and that they don't get angry, they don't get sad, they don't feel negative emotions. And that we can just send out messages and they could just say, I'm not gonna read your messages. But we don't know all of these circumstances and I can really, feel that situation right now because her, the bullying led to maybe not the suicide the reason for suicide but the bullying definitely had a contribution to her decision to commit suicide that's what i'm feeling right now on saturday the day of her death the Okama native tweeted i have received nearly a hundred honest opinions every day and i cannot deny that i got hurt fuji tv had already stopped shooting of the show in line with national measures taken during the coronavirus pandemic. U.S. video streaming services Netflix, which <laughs> U.S. video streaming service Netflix, which distributes the Japanese reality show with English subtitles, said it would refra refrain from streaming new episodes, but viewers can still watch Terrace House episodes that have already been distributed. So Ichiro Matsunai, Mats Matsutani, Matsutani, an expert on social informational studies, said it was hardly surprising that Fuji TV decided to terminate the series, but the broadcaster must also examine and its own responsibility why a situation like this has occurred. Why a situation like this has occurred? I think it's it's uncontrollable. It's it's probably uncontrollable for for the TV broadcasters because they're trying to make Terrace House as realistic as possible. But I think that there's some partial blame on people's reactions to the TV show that probably sparked this whole controversy. And I don't think bullying is okay, or cyberbullying is, is definitely, I've never been cyberbullied, but I don't think it's okay to to do that. I, I wonder why I've never been cyberbullied, I don't, I don't know. But um, I can only remember one instance of bullying in my life where um, someone said to me that you probably should have died in that car crash. And uh, it was like my old karate bully. My, my bully was in my karate class, I remember. And um, it was like the karate kid kind of thing. But, 
Bullying is not okay. That's what I'm. Well, that's what I'm trying to say. Matsuni, Matsutani, Matsutani also pointed out that suicides have occurred among cast members of reality shows overseas, and some of the programs offer counseling services by profession by professionals to the cast. Broadcasters may have to think about how to care for the mental health of the reality show cast. He said, adding that having broadcasters on management agencies rather than the cast members themselves be in charge of the social media account is one option to take. I think that's an idea to 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 solve this kind of interaction. You know, like on Twitch we have mods and mods look out in chat to make sure that like the messages aren't bad. And I think having like a mod for reality show TV hosts like social media accounts wouldn't be a bad take to prevent things like this from happening. Terrace House Tokyo 2019-2020 is the latest in a series that began in 2012. Wow, Terrace House began in 2012. That is crazy. That's been eight years. Wow. And I think it's pretty interesting that this is the first time something to this degree has happened. Well, maybe it's not. I'd have to look a little deeper to figure that out. But it's very unfortunate to hear that someone felt the need to take their life because of mean tweets, mean social media posts on the internet. The current series, which began in May last year, features three women and three men sharing in a, ho- a house in Tokyo. The cast members are looking for love while living under the same roof, and there is no script in the show according to Netflix. That is some serious news. Read today, read on the japantoday.com category entertainment update fuji tv to an end reality show terrace house after cast members death if y'all want to read the the article yourself you can read it today it was put it was posted yesterday and i actually met one of the members of terrace house in japan week in madrid last year having that connection to someone that's actually on the show kind of made me feel for this measure a lot more. So I don't think Terrace House is, like I said in the beginning of the video, I don't think Terrace House is going to be canceled indefinitely. I just think that this season is going to be canceled because of the repercussions of social media and cyberbullying. Hey, hey, hey. I don't really know what else to say on the matter, but to any of you that like Terrace House, I would just send send love and prayers to to her family, to to Hana Kimura's family, and tell her that they supported her daughter because that's a rough thing to digest. Anyway, YouTube, that's the video for today. I'll see you later. Bye bye.